Hello everybody, welcome back to the workshop. So today I want to talk a little bit about work harder. So oftentimes it is said, and it's normally overly stated, work smarter, not harder. Now, this has a lot of implications, and generally this you can find to be true. You always want to find more efficient ways or smarter ways of doing something, okay? But I would like to take and go contrary to this point for just a minute. And hopefully this will inspire some guys to get up off the couch, stop watching my YouTube videos for just a minute, and get out in their forges. So, everything in life, especially if you live in the great country that is America, you have every opportunity handed to you to provide an income for yourself or to be able to go after those dreams and those hopes and goals. I'm right now, I'm living my dream. I've always wanted to be a blacksmith ever since I was a little kid. And today I'm proud to say that I am a professional blacksmith full time for a living. And I really enjoy this. I enjoy telling people this. And I just enjoy my job. There's a lot of things I dislike about blacksmithing professionally. But all in all, it's like a walk in the park. Comparatively to what I have done previously in my life. So, it does not come without a cost. The cost of doing this means I have to hustle harder than someone who punches a clock from the 9 to 5. This isn't a bad thing. It just means I have to work harder. I can only get so efficient at doing a process or a craft that just takes the time that it takes. So what are you left with then? If there's so many hours, only so many hours in the day, then what are you to do with those hours? I hear oftentimes there's people who complain, well, I don't have enough time for this, I don't have enough time for that, I don't have enough time for this. And frankly, I've done the same. All that is excuses. It's excuses and not taking ownership of your own destiny. Now, that's going to sound really frank. And for some, I'm probably going to get some dislikes for that. But that is okay. You can always find something else to do. You can always work a little harder. You can always put in an extra hour or two in the workshop for the day. There's always something that you can take and leverage. And ultimately, you put your time and effort into the things that you care the most about. If you care the most about your family and spending family time, don't spend all night in the workshop and then claim you never have time for your family. As this is a moronic statement, it's the work will still be there when you get back up the next morning. You just need to set better goals and boundaries for yourself. Anything that we want in life can be achieved. It's not always the best, it, you know, it's not always cupcakes and roses and all that jazz. But guess what? You can go after the things that you want. If you want to be better at smithing or you want to progress at something, all you have to do is just work a little harder. If you want to be the best dad on the face of this planet, all you have to do is put the time in, put the effort in, and work harder. So I hope I encourage you today to get off the couch and start attacking those things that you've always wanted to do. God bless you, and we'll catch you on the next one.